Hi, Veron, how are you? Hello, yes, I'm Great. fine. <laughs> nice, nice. So, um, was it easy to get on? I had to reboot my system, so it may have, it may have blocked you for a moment. Um, was it easy to get on? Yes, it did, actually. You know, it waited a few minutes. Okay. You say you say your host is not on. It, I, my system needed to be rebooted, and it let me know last minute. So I apologize about that. Uh, let me send out. Okay, so let me see one second. I think Gary's trying to get on. I don't know how he didn't get it. Uh, one second. Because you got the link. Okay, one second. My name. Uh, tell me how, uh, while I do that, tell me how the Jigong, Jigong is going, your practice. Yeah, that's fine. I, I, I practice every morning. That's quite good. <laughs> yes. Great. Great, great. And you're making, you're seeing a difference? Not yet. Uh, not yet. Uh, but I, I'm also doing some yoga, but I see a bit difference in my, in my strength, in the legs. Yeah. It means a bit, bit stronger in. Are they having trouble coming in? Hi, Gary. Hi, Gary, can you hear? Uh, yes, I can. How are you? I am fine, but Eleanor disappeared. Ah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see her? I couldn't see her. Oh, okay. Okay. How have you been? Yeah, yeah, fine, yeah. Are you still in lockdown there? Uh, yeah, we've our road out of lockdown to a long way away, so... Oh, got, dear. Oh, dear. Uh, we've got another... Uh, till about the 5th of November, I think. The 5th of November? Yeah. That was another month, month, month and a half, two months. Yeah, yeah, six weeks or thereabouts, yeah. Really that bad? It's, it's not that bad, is it? Oh, yeah. uh, we're in, Mel this is in Melbourne, we're getting 500 a day at the moment, so. Oh, uh, yeah. So it's uh, going through, um, yeah, and they've given us a, a roadmap out of lockdown and it's all based on uptake of vaccination rates at 70 right. or 80. Yeah. So there's not much going to be happening over the next six weeks. Oh. Oh, 
Well, that is a bit disappointing, isn't it? Uh, it is, yeah. yeah. Um, but look, it is what it is. Can't do much about it. Um, and just trying to just deal with what we can control and not, yeah. not what we can't control. So you you are in summer or winter now? Uh, we we're, we're in we're in spring. We're heading into winter. Although it was uh, six degrees when I got up this morning. So. Oh, okay. Yeah, so it's just that um, that time where there's a bit of weather fluctuation, warm and cold, and a fair bit of rain as well. What what happened to my Oh, actually, uh, you know? uh, uh, well, I've spoken to him uh, a couple yeah. of weeks ago, uh, just to touch base. And, uh, oh, it's, uh, looks like here we go. Thank you for. <laughs> oh, <laughs> there you are. I come back. <laughs> Thank you for your patience. Technology. What are we gonna do? about sometimes um, drives us crazy, but we need it, right? Just like a spot. <laughs> <laughs> we depend on it. Thank you for your patience, I apologize. So okay. no more surprises. And um, yeah, um, I have to check why you're not getting it, Gary, because you, sh you should have got it, uh, the reminder link, but I'll, uh, I'll check, okay? Hopefully it doesn't end oh. up. Um, um, let me make a note. I check with my IT on my weekly meeting. Welcome, everybody. And uh, so um, I have some uh, fun news. Um, so first of all, uh, Bernice is going to um, co-host the... Um, masterminds with me next month and it's all uh, gonna be about how would you summarize in one or two sentences Bernice okay so um hi we're gonna work on the Enneagram and we're gonna this is a um a personality uh assessment and how these personalities work in relationships and that's going to basically be what we're going to talk on beautiful and it can help in both personal and business yes yes absolutely we need to use it in both ways actually in all ways it's a good idea great and then um so the, and next month is my yoga teacher and uh, showing a different type of yoga but also the mindset and the breathing around which we need for boosting up immunity, getting through these uncertain times. So I figure you'll, 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 I mean, she's almost 70 and she looks like 30. I don't know how she does it, all natural. So she'll teach us her secrets. Um, so I think it'll be a lot of fun. And then I would like you, uh, Veron, to um, perhaps commit to the December mastermind with some Qigong. And of course, you oh. on it separately, so you're prepared, okay? <laughs> what do you think? What do you think? Little pressure, just not too much. Uh, uh, yeah, I, I, yeah, I can. I, I, I'll take a look into it. Yeah, I, I've got time to prepare here, so. Okay, lovely. I'm excited, and then of course you can repurpose it for, for your circles and your network. All right, great. So. Um, the other piece of news is um, is um, we'll finish the month nice and strong with this different method with this methodology, and then I'll switch it up a little bit for next month. I already um, told Gary in a way that um, you will work on three areas at a time but I'll make it nice and easy so you have faster progress, okay? I'll, I'll explain it to you next month when we get to it. And 
and uh, to make it easier on people and to teach so that um, participants and members and you have more time to prepare, etc. We'll always make them the first Monday, first week of the month and the third week of the month because then you have the mastermind in between so I don't want to overwhelm you with events and I want you to take one week off a month to sort of, you know, uh, we can have our private session then or, or just uh, take it and or just take inventory because uh, you also need to uh, recharge, okay? So, but I'll, uh, I'll remind you as we move forward. So I'm happy you're all here. It's a small but special group. And um, let's just see how we uh, did this past week, okay? So the focus is always on what went well and what we need to improve, okay? So um, that's what a leader always asks himself or herself. What went well, what we need to improve. What went well, what do we need to improve? What is it? Let me hear from you. <laughs> what went well and what needed to improve. Exactly. Okay, so um, let's start with you, Gary. Go for it. What went well, what needs to improve? Um, what went well, um, I've started uh, back with our uh, client uh, that uh, we've just been on hold due to lockdown circumstances. And uh, yes. so we've rescheduled two sessions this week to get back into it. Uh, what needs to improve? Um, just my use of time, probably a bit better than I've I've had a few very good weeks, a couple of challenges last week. Uh, so just, yeah, just using my time the way that I plan to a bit better than what I have. Very, very well said. Thank you. Thank you for your honesty. And um, what about you, Veron? What went well? What needs to improve? Uh, yes, what went well is uh, there are... Uh, some many many uh, new opportunities many new, new deals uh, yeah. on on the table and i'm looking at, at them what need to be improved is i have to be more uh structure i think in in in, in analyzing them and, and putting them into paper and uh, be more speed speed up in in communication with the other parties. Okay, okay, thank you. Thank you, very well defined, both of you. And Bernice, welcome back. I put it in the message, private message. Oh, well, um, going well, uh, very well, but I think for myself personally, I took a break, you know, uh, what I really like trying to figure out. And I think it was good to take this break. I think, um, um, uh, you know, the new season is my thing that I need to do for myself in terms of. Oh, I don't know what connection. I apologize. Um, no problem. So yeah. maybe, maybe, maybe choppy too. Yeah, uh, I'm wired in. Um, so maybe, maybe remove the video, although you look beautiful. We saw that. Just to <laughs> slash bandwidth. There you go. Let's see if it's any better. Okay. Try okay. Again. So just to better. okay, just to wrap just to wrap up, um, I'm going to reevaluate uh, what I want my future to look like for me personally in terms of what I want to be doing. I think financials, but I think it's pretty much uh, set 
that course. And I really need looking at more of like, what does Bernice want to do? So that's what I'm going to be focusing. Focus inwards. Wonderful. Yeah. Uh, a little bit of world news, Gary and Veron. Um, the East Coast of the US has been going through a lot of um, weather, funny weather, hurricane, et cetera, you name it. So maybe, maybe Bernice is um, being affected by some of that. Uh, on the West Coast, we had other stuff, fires, et cetera. But yeah, it's always something. But <laughs> I can definitely relate to outages and connections because I've had my share um, lately. So uh, hopefully it will improve. Okay, so good job. So let's keep that in mind. And um, so today we're going to focus on relationships. Okay, before we come up with some fun new relationship goals and actions, is there anything for accountability that uh, in any other area that you um, want to carry forward into this last week of the month and the quarter? Any of you, um, take a moment and please let me know in the chat box. And... I'll do it with you. Um, there you go. You can hold me to it. Please do. Please do. <laughs> okay. um, that's what I'm carrying forward. Any of you, uh, this, this part is optional, but I wanted to see if any of you has uh, any action to carry forward. Not, not relationship related, because we'll focus on that momentarily. Bernice financial goals, tracking money, fantastic, fantastic. We all got to track money. And as Gary said, time, the biggest resources we have. If we don't track, we don't know what to change, right? Because it all looks the same. It's hard to manipulate. And I mean it, manipulate variable, tweak variable to improve if we don't know what to tweak, what to manipulate. So we got to isolate it. The only way to isolate it, as we do in science, is to track. And by the way, coaching is not considered the science, but I am a scientist, and I always promise you, I bring as much science as possible to the sessions to back up um, what we're doing. Yeah. So I hope you appreciate that from my psychology background. Okay, Gary, find the right time of the day for regular exercise. Very good, very good, very good, very good. That's something I also need to do with my trainer who kept switching my schedule around. <laughs> All right, good. All right, so in relation is really anything, any, any relation. It can be the relationship with yourself, okay, such as, so that's part of spirituality, I guess. Um, and I all, I really do want all of you to have a better relationship with your own self. This relationship with your own self has been tested during COVID more and more, right? As the relationship with others has also been, been tested, including with animals and um the environment, plants, etc., around us. Okay, so all of that is included personally and professionally. You see some examples here, could be, you know, more quality time. I want to remind you that's one of the five love languages. If you want to brush up on that, on that concept, the five love languages, you don't need to read the book necessarily, although you'll find a free copy at any of your local libraries 
or you can just go to on the internet, even on their website, and there are tests and summaries. You don't need to buy anything. There's a lot of free information. Okay. All right. So remember that um, everything comes from relations, money, investments, business, work, jobs. So cultivate them strategically. When people trust you, you gain their trust and vice versa, they'll be happy to share their contacts. And that is really the best form of um, marketing, warm market, because somebody who knows somebody or that you have in common, a relationship you have in common is more likely to, to um, treat you better uh, because you know, there, is, there is a level of extra connection there. You have something in common. Okay, so let's look short term. We're about to finish the month and quarter and start the last quarter of the month. And so let's look long term. Maybe you can start looking at the last quarter of the 2021 and beyond. Okay, let's see what comes up. I give you plenty of time. Do this exercise with um, your higher self and start relationship focus. Very good. I wanna see what you have to say and then I have a big compliment to pay you and an insight. 
um, who wants to go first? <clears throat> I can. Please. For me, in the short term, it's just uh, catch up for a conversation with a couple of old friends. One's an ex-colleague from the UK and we haven't spoken for some time. So just uh, touching base and uh, re, uh, oh, not re-establishing, but uh, maintaining that, uh, that friendship um, on the long term is developing new relationships with business owners that may be looking to either grow their business or sell their business in the future. Nice. How do you know that UK? Um... Uh, it's someone that I used to work with um, and uh, in travels, I've spent time at his house when I've been traveling over there and he spent time here when he's traveled to Australia. So fabulous. We just haven't had a chat for a while. So, yeah. How special, how special. Very nice. Great. Bernice, thank you for writing it. And uh, let, let's hear it out loud too. Okay, I just hope it doesn't get choppy. <laughs> so um, I want to improve communication with others and I wanted specifically to increase to others in a nice way when I need to end a conversation without hurting feelings. That my, something I really want to learn. I find that there are people in my life who uh, they like to go on and on, and I don't always have time, but I don't want to be mean, but I can't, but I can't listen to it. So um, yeah, I'm looking for like a, a pleasant way of getting off the phone or ending the conversation nicely. You can't listen to it because of time or because you know that doesn't doesn't go anywhere. Right? It yeah, it doesn't go anywhere. It doesn't go. I would spend hours if I knew it could go somewhere. If I was really, truly helping someone, I would stay with them for hours. But when I know that we're just, you know, playing games, I, I, I feel like I've grown up too much and I'm past it. And I just... Absolutely. Uh, that's great. I think we all need to do that. You know, interrupt people politely and with love and letting them know <laughs> they, better, they better invest their time into what's working versus you know wasting their time going down that rabbit hole so well done it's I'll have not a it yeah go ahead bernice it, it still cuts out a little bit but oh sorry i just wanted to add that um the people are not like friends or, you know, so we're talking or co workers sure. about like my children, uh, even my husband sometimes, sorry to say, but I love him so much and he definitely wants to talk to me about things, but it can get repetitive and I can't handle the repetitiveness of it. So <laughs> we can relate. Very good. Well said. Thank you, Bernice. Good point. Okay. We'll break that down. And uh, Veron, Veron, go for it, darling. I'm mute. Yes, okay. I, I divide it into three parts actually self, others, and business. For yeah. self, with um, more um, attention to self, rest, and uh, daily acknowledgement and sort of our, our self-understanding. For other people, it's, it's a sharing, you know, uh, what I can do for them and appreciation and spend time with them. And for business is um, to really know about the what kind of customer or investor I want and how to build and nurture and, and, and sustain the relationship on the long term. Beautiful, beautiful. Wow. What level of depth all of you have. You're just master members. <laughs> master <laughs> participants. Coach the coach here. Very good. I have to say that um, all of you, I don't know if it's a coincidence, but um, 
personally have had really strong and long relationships. And I think each and every one of you has something to teach others, whether you do it formally or informally, directly or in indirectly. I cannot say I have the same, okay? Um, for whatever reason, you know, I bounced continents through continents in my life, just like drinking water or coffee. And um, maybe that wasn't conducive to long, deep relationships, but you all do. You all um, have really long and deep relationships. Some of the young generations that I work with think in their head or believe in their head that that's no longer possible with the change of times, especially with personal relationships. I would love to challenge that, that belief um, because you are product of the product. You have been able to, to do it. So I know it's possible. And I don't think even with the different times, I don't even think people change that fast. But yeah, that's just some good food for thought. Okay, so no problem, Bernice. Um, we, I just, uh, we'll skip this step because also the problem with the technology today. I just wanna know, let me see it in the chat box. How many of you do visualizations and how often? Please see me in, let me see in the chat box. I wanna know you, that practice of yours, that habit of yours. How, um, how often do you do it? Then we'll get into the mastermind. Okay, and since uh, you all have really amazing life partners, you know, that's something you can also do with your life partner um, at a designated time of day or week, depending on how often you want to do it. That's really good practice, okay? We, all of us, myself included, don't put enough time into visualizing what we want in our bright future. So I'd like to encourage you to do that a little more often, okay? On your own time, especially now that we're ending the end of the year. Okay, I'll put you in breakout room. Bernice, go first, okay? And let's brainstorm new ways, new ways. Give each other feedback, please. Give one another feedback. I'll give you plenty of time to um, strategize your, um, your amazing relationships and these amazing relationship goals and go. Veron and Bernice joined the breakout room. Gary's there by himself. <laughs> I don't have the link. Uh, the, the blue button should have appeared to go there. Oh, okay. Bernice, do you see it? Bernice, you there? Do you see the breakout room? I, I don't know how to put you there. Uh, you have to click on the, I think it's the blue button that says join breakout room. Yep, well, in the chat box.
Okay. Um, so, Bernice, uh, let me, I'm going to try to unmute you. Can you hear us? Can you even hear us? Bernice, yeah, I think your computer must be frozen. Okay, I cannot even unmute you, but if you can unmute, uh, breakout room, let me let them know. Um,
All right, welcome back. Um, I think we lost Bernice. I'm not able to get any sign of life from her. Um, so uh, was it helpful? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Good job. Did you have enough time? Yeah. Oh, yes. Yes. Okay. Good job managing your time. All right. So give yourself lots of love. And uh, all right, let's. Um, what's the word? Um, actionable. Let's make, let's define some actionable item uh, to, to move us forward, okay? At least one relationship, one new relationship action to. Um, be able to wrap up this month nice and strong. And I want you to when take your time, look at your calendar and let us know what you can do when, what you can do when. I'll do it with you and start. Beautiful. Okay. Veron, where are you going to make a list? I'm curious. I'm mute. This week, by yeah. Friday. Yeah, where? Where are you going to make a list? Oh, where I, I I do it in in a notebook. So, okay, yeah. That, All right. That's it. 
Just checking. Uh, good old uh, notebook, just in case technology fails you, so you have a backup. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Gary. Sir Gary. Yes, I'm just going to make a call to my friend in the UK on Wednesday evening. I've just looked up the time zone differences, so now I know where we sit. So. Oh, perfect. You'll, you'll be available then? Uh, I should be, yeah. Yeah, if not, we'll we'll pick a time to I I, I can usually catch him. So lovely, lovely, bravo, bravo, nice double whammy because we are involving other people in our amazing new actions. So this deserves a nice reward. Remember, your rewards you can keep for yourself. You can be selfish and or share with anybody you wish. Okay, here are some ideas. Most of them are COVID proof. Yeah. Um, nothing food related for me. Um, <laughs> so, um, yeah. Um, the hop hair balloon, I've been wanting to do it. Um, I just have to book it. So it's probably not going to be for another month or so due to my travels. And um, but I am gardening. Mike keeps keeps in touch. hasn't been able to be on these calls. And uh, so far, I've planted strawberry, basil, and tomatoes. But this is planting season here, so I give myself a budget for some more exotic or less exotic variety of produce i keep you posted on my green thumb efforts once you have your reward feel free to share it here if you need more time you can share it in the private group Perfect. Oh, wow, look at that sauce. Nice, nice, sounds lovely. Spice up, spice up your life. Great. What about you, Veron? Oh, that sounds lovely. We would love to see a picture of you wearing it, okay? Maybe you can post it in our private Facebook group. Okay, so uh, you know all our links, but I've been thinking, so I'm really um, pushing, pushing my um, coach certification because that's, that's, that's an info product that is passive. Um, I can sell in my sleep and I encourage you eventually to come up with something similar. And um, I'm not necessarily, you know, um, taking on new, new, new uh, coaching clients because that, that's not passive. Um, and uh, the retreat, that's not passive, but I'm, I'm hoping to do it next year, you know, with all graces of the universe during these crazy times. But um, because you two have been so loyal to yourself and your success, to the work and to me, and um, I'm like a dog, I'm a loyal person too. And I, I do um, reward loyalty. So I would love to gift you, gift you, um, it's really worth $10,000 or more, but I've been lowering the price because of COVID and I kept it low. But I would love to give it to you for free. The oh. entire um, Rich Coach University. I don't think I've given it to you, right, guys? Did I give you access? No. Oh. no. No. Okay. There's lots, of, there's almost 30 modules on there. Don't go crazy, okay? I don't want to overwhelm yeah. you. Take your own time. I can, if you're okay with that, um, 
I can set I can set you up with your user and password uh, on Wednesday when I have my IT meeting. Uh, consume it at your own time. All I would want from you, and then I can give you a certification. You know, when, once you completed it, is uh, just some honest feedback. Honest feedback um, on what you think, what you think we could improve, if it's too difficult, too hard, too fast, too slow, whatever it is, okay? Uh, and obviously all, all I ask for it is your time in going through it at your own leisure to, you know, to check it out, to consume it. Okay, thank you so much. <laughs> that is a yeah, big that's... surprise. <laughs> Uh, that's amazing. Thank you, Elena. Yeah. yeah. Um, Good. Thank you. And so that you know, um, yes, because um, eventually I'll have this, this course certified with ICF, International Coach Certification, mm -hmm. entire course uh, certified. So which right now it, it is the biggest coaching entity out there, the Etc. You know, but before I, I submit it for <laughs> certification, I would love more feedback from you, from anybody, from you especially, so that so that it's as good as it as it, can, it could be, right? Yeah, there you go. Okay, so uh, with your permission, I'll send you everything on Wednesday, Thursday for you, Gary, and okay. uh, you did really well. Um, so I'll um, see you next week. Okay, and then from uh, I remind you, I remind you then from October on, we'll do first month, first uh, week of the month, and third week of the month is gonna be the the methodology is gonna be different. You'll have a little more actions, okay, and in between we can keep in touch privately. So um, you're off the hook unless you have any other question. I have time if you if you if you if you have question or if you need to comment on something. Well done. Enjoy these great actions. Oh, Bernice, you're back. There you I'm go. Back. Don't be not. Sorry. <laughs> okay. So um, okay, I'll catch you up. Uh, who wants to catch up, uh, Bernice? <laughs> I'm so sorry. Thank you, don't everyone. Worry, don't worry. I, I, my technology didn't even work either at the beginning of the call. So sorry about that. Uh, Anybody? These things are sent to try. Thank you. Yes. Thank you very much. Look forward to it. Yes. Okay. So, Bernice, two things, um, three things. Um, do you have your relationship actions or action? Uh, I don't think I got a chance to get that far. I just finished off with the want. So I didn't really develop an action plan, but I'll do an action you do it towards, I think I need to <laughs> research it a little bit. Yeah. Okay. So, I think I'm going to look online. That's my two, but I, I do enjoy doing that and see if there's um I I think I should be able to might be helpful. Um but I'm not really sure where to go with the specific activists. Sorry, your connection is quite funny. Uh you're not sure. Where to go for specific action for my want to increase communication, you know, to be able to say things in a nice way. Yeah, um, that's, a, that's really good. So, I mean, I like to say, I like to say, I mean, Gary gave you a suggestion earlier, which is, you know, we need to wrap it up on time because we, you, you don't even need to say why. We need to wrap it up on time. So hopefully they realize they're just wasting time vomiting unnecessary stuff on you and they go back to what's important. That's one way. Um, or you can use both. You can say, hey, uh, we need to wrap it up on time. So, um, so, and let's stay focused on what you want and what's supporting you 
because what you focus on expands. So hopefully they change, they shift to all that negative, for lack of better words, vomiting, unnecessary stuff <laughs> that okay. nobody needs to hear. Okay, those are, those yeah. are good things. Great. Okay. Yeah, but so, don't, don't, so don't use that um, analogy, okay, um, on them. They, they are not going to like it. That's between me and you. Uh, the vomit. <laughs> right. Yeah. But, okay, thank you. You're welcome. Good. Do, do you have a reward for it? Um, yeah. Soon, and one enjoy is um, so I'm really hoping to uh, ride a bike. Yeah, and that's on. Yes, that's awesome. I'm always good. Good. Yeah, and you'll be able to reboot your connection before next time. Just the uh, temporary. Sorry, okay. that it was all good. All good. All good. So, um, yeah. As of uh, the other two announcements, really quick um, to respect other people's time. As of uh, tomorrow, next week we're on as usual. We we'll wrap up the month nice and strong. As of um, October, we will meet every other week, first week of the month, third week of the month. The coaching methodology will be slightly different. You'll have three actions and we'll look at three areas of life at a time, okay? To help you guys uh, progress faster, okay? And heighten the accountability. And last but not least, I offered for free um, to all of you, because you're so loyal, my um, coach certification. I know you're already a coach, uh, Bernice, eventually this certification is going to be ICF, International Coach Certification Certified. I'm working on it. Uh, and before I submit it for that international certification, the best in my opinion, I would love for you, my trusted members and clients to just go through it. It's lengthy at your own pace, no rush. Um, and give me feedback so I can improve maybe certain things that could be too long or too short or too fast or too slow, whatever it is. So if you're up for it, um, you'll just take a little bit of your time. You'll get $10,000 plus worth of free material. And I can send you the um, password on Wednesday. And you can think about it if you want and email me. Okay. So. Um, that's all. I think we may have lost you again. Thank you all <laughs> for your, uh, you good, Bernice? Okay. It's gone again. Yeah, yes. It's going on in my house right now. I can tell you what's going on. Okay. I'm still muted. <laughs> yes. Okay. Sounds good. I'll send you an email to just make sure you got everything. Have a great week, everybody. Ciao. Good job. You too. Have a great Bye. week, everyone. Thank you, Elena. And thanks Bye. again, Elena. Pleasure. Appreciate it. Thank you all. You're amazing. Take care. See you.